This is a demonstration video on how to operate and program your new Bulldog Magnum RFID vault. First thing you want to do is take your vault out of the box and locate the following items. You'll need the emergency keys, the RFID access devices, which is the key fob and the access card. But most importantly, you'll need to locate the owner's manual, which has the schematic drawing, and go ahead and familiarize yourself with the key items that you'll need to locate during this process. So first thing you'll want to do is remove the emergency key cover. It's a magnetic cover you press on either side. You'll insert your key into the lock, turn it to the right clockwise. This will open the vault, then go ahead and install four quality AA batteries per the instructions. I'll give you a few moments to do that and then we'll zoom in and take a closer look at how to program your vault. Now that you've installed the batteries in your safe, let's test the general function. For these next few steps, you'll need to locate the following items. The programming button, which is on the inside right corner, and the power on button, which is the zero in Bulldog. So let's test the factory code, which is one, two, three, four. To do this, you'll press the power on button and enter the factory code of one, two, three, four. So now I'll show you how to program your own unique code. You can choose any four to eight digit code. For this demonstration, I'm gonna use four, three, two, one. For this step, we'll press the power on button, which is the zero, or press and release the program button one time. Now let's enter four, three, two, one. And to confirm that, we'll press and release the programming button again one time. Now the code should be set to our new code. To test it, we'll press the power on button, enter four, three, two, one. In the next step, I'll show you how to program the RFID devices, but it's important to let this safe cycle for 30 seconds. We'll cut away and come back to you. Now I'll show you how to program your RFID devices. We'll start with the RFID access card. In this step, you will not need to press the power on button like you did to change the code. We'll simply press the programming button one time and release and you'll hear two beeps and two flashes. Now we'll have to hold the RFID card over the sensor area, which is the zero in Bulldog. We'll press and release the programming button again. You'll see a series of four flashes and four beeps, which is confirming the acceptance of your new code. It's important to note that the RFID area can vary a little bit. In this vault, it seems to be a little bit below the zero. You'll want to check your vault to find the perfect area, which will never change and will always be the same. To open the vault using our new device, we just hold the card over the area, and the vault will open just like that. So now let me show you how to program the key fob. This safe will take up to five RFID devices. You can do a combination of cards and key fobs, or all key fobs, or all cards. We'll program this device the same way we just did the other. We'll press and release the program button one time. We'll hold the key fob over the RFID sensor area. We'll hit the two beeps, press and release the button again. Now we we'll simply hold the RFID key fob over the area and your vault's working. One last thing to note, if you would like to clear out all of the RFID cards to start over, all you'll do is hold in the programming button for five seconds. I'm holding it in now. After five seconds, you'll hear a series of beeps and it'll light up solid blue. Now you can reprogram the cards. If you have any trouble programming your vault, it's my suggestion that you try that first. Go ahead and just hold that in five seconds. Delete the, all the key fobs. Please also note that that will not delete the four digit code we did in the first step. That will stay until you change it. Even with the batteries out of the safe, it will remember the chips. If you have any trouble programming your safe, give us a call at 1-800-843-3483. Okay.